So I've, I've tried it um, with probably the same thing that you tried, split body. You select the, the body that you want to split. And then usually the default is extend splitting tool, I believe. And then you select the splitting tool and usually you should be able to select the surface. And um, that should actually split this part off. But unfortunately, it would also split this, uh, this um, domed surface off here, which is something you probably don't want. Um, so there's a, there's a fairly easy workaround for that. You have to create yourself some geometry to split this off. So one way to do that is actually to go into the patchwork space and simply create an offset of this surface here of exactly, oops, I didn't want all that. I just want that. So when you, uh, when you have selected chain selection, then it selects the complete chain of surfaces, including that bridge here. I don't want this and you'll see why. So I okay this and there's that surface body. Of course, it has this gap in here. I'm just gonna fill this with a loft. And then stitch this together to make one surface out of it. And now when I go to split body and that, uh, that command is in the patch as well as in the model environment, I pick my body and then I'm going to pick my surface here and then uh, I have split this off. So the, the workaround is usually to build yourself some surface. If, if you can't build a good line, so in this case, you could have also created a sketch on the side face here um, and uh, just sketch the line and split this with a line. But duplicating that surface and splitting it off with the surface is probably a better idea. But in general, if you want to 3D print this, you don't have any registration marks where this piece is going to sit. So you can do that differently as well. Let's undo all this. Um, another method would be to simply, what is this here? Oh, I had, okay, I can, I can go a few steps back. So another step would be, another method would be to create yourself a sketch on this surface here. And I'm going to project these two points into that sketch. Then I'm just going to sketch a little yeah, I don't know what to call it, a cutout. And maybe I'm going to dimension that. Also, this, this menu that I'm bringing up here, that's the sketch toolbox. If you're in a model environment, it's the model toolbox, it's context sensitive. And if you type in commands in here, you can add these commands to, to that toolbox by clicking on that little hook here uh, on that command that you want to add. And if you press the S key, that's, um, that's that toolbox. And this makes crazy noises. Anyway, so now that I have sketch this u-shape i'll stop the sketch and usually you start in the model environment so in this case i create an extrude of that complete u-shape and that extrusion instead of giving it a distance i say to object and the object is that rear face and it complains but i'll check this option and then it does this fine okay so now this uh, this u-shape the surface is exactly as deep as this, um, as this, um, I'm not sure what to call this, this thing. And I'm going to do something similar. I'm going to close the rear surface or the rear face here, stitch it together into one, into one body. Here, that's one body. Unhide this. And now I can use that, uh, that body to split this off. Same thing again, modify, split body. I select the body I want to split. I select splitting tool. Hmm. Somehow. Uh, 
I'll just select that entire body there in the uh, in the browser if selecting it here in the viewport doesn't lead to the results I want and I click OK and if I hide this then uh, there you have split it off now of course when you 3d print it you don't have any clearance in here so what you can do is you basically just simply go ahead and go back into the model environment and use a little bit of surface offset so take this 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 and this maybe get it give it minus 0.2 millimeters so now when you print this out you have a little bit of clearance and then you can just glue those parts together so uh, hopefully that helps